two times. Two times I hit the leave bloggerheads button and I just sat there in bloggerhead purgatory uh, forever. I guess all it seemed to do was one by one delete all my videos, comments, and blogs several months. Um, <laughs> I guess when you've been here for a really long time, it takes a really long time to leave the site. I had thought about it a couple of times um, during the holidays that I just needed to um, walk away for a while. And I've been thinking about it a lot, too. I mean, I, I realized a couple of things today. First of all, I don't always speak what I really believe. I'm a very honest person when it comes to telling you what I think to an extent. I hold a lot of stuff back because I don't want to hurt people's feelings. So I'm not honest with myself in that aspect because I hold things in and... I think it, but I don't say it. And I've always been the type of person where I like to say exactly everything I think. I don't, I don't want to be the type of person that thinks something but doesn't say it or says something else. I got a lot of stuff going on right now, and I really need to focus on my life. And I, and I need to step back from vlogger heads and and get my shit in order and I'm not doing that when um, I continue to watch videos or make comments or make a video I just have a lot of shit on my mind so I'm just tired of holding stuff in. Just tired of holding stuff in. I mean, I already know that I got the, you know, bad girl persona on the side for speaking my mind in the first place and saying things that other people, you know, don't agree in. But, I mean, come on. It's who I am. I can't help it. I can't change who I am. I mean, I guess I could change who I am, but if I was to change who I am, then I really wouldn't be honest because that is who I am. It's, it's not going to change. I'm just babbling right now. I know that. I don't want to call people out in videos. I don't, I don't want to turn around and, and tell people when I think they're fucked up in the head or I think they're on drugs. I don't want to tell people when I think they're addicted to uh, the video sharing site. I don't want to tell people when I think they're lying or crooked or they have some hidden agenda. In fact, you know, my name should be Lima the Skeptic or the Cynic because I think I'm outweighing Sid a lot lately. I feel bad because I do enjoy watching a lot of people's videos a lot. And I think that there are some users on the site that not many people watch that look forward to hearing from me. And I feel bad when I don't, when I can't watch everybody's video. It makes me feel guilty. Like I'm letting people down. And I don't like that feeling. Because I can't. I mean, it's just, there's so many videos. I, I can't keep up. I got too much stuff going on. It just seemed like it would be easier if I just clicked that button and got on with doing with what I needed to get done. I don't have any desire to post videos at YouTube, really. It's just not the same atmosphere. It's not the same community. It's not the feedback that I'm looking for. I like the community of Vloggerheads. I love a lot of people on Vloggerheads, but at the same time, if I can't be honest with you and tell you what I think, then 
I mean, what does it really amount to? I mean, stop and think about it. It doesn't amount to anything. If people want me to sit here and, and tell them what they want to hear, well, that's not doing them any good or me any good. I'm not, you know, I, I want to sit here and I want to start calling out people and just saying, look, this is what I'm thinking right now about this. This is what I'm thinking right now about that. Blah, 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 blah. But it would be mean. I mean, it would be, it would be totally evil. <laughs> it would be, you know, I'd have the scarlet letter. I'd be wearing it around my neck for life. I hate the fact that I want to be notified when I have a comment or somebody's replied to my comment or um, I have email. If I want to keep that function on, then I have to deal with another function. People who constantly, 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 constantly advertise their videos. Cut the fucking shit out. It drives me crazy. It's something I have to put up with in order to get notifications on everything else. I have to get notifications every time you make a video. Well, good freaking Lord. We can all see you've made a video. You don't have to post it 20 times to people saying, hey, check the video out. I hate that, <laughs> you know? I hate that. Oh my God, it drives me freaking insane. I mean, I understand that this is all some people have, and so they're staying busy and they're staying focused and they're probably trying not to think about things that might be going on in their real life, so it's easier for them to focus on this. But some people are going over the extremes, and I can't keep up. It, it's becoming a little obnoxious. And then some of the comments that some people leave are obnoxious and it's like I feel like I just can't respond to any of that stuff because I'm the one that's gonna look like the bad guy I, I don't like when people use certain situations going on in their life as an excuse for their behavior that drives me freaking insane and then I can't respond on that either because I'll look like a bad person who has no compassion so I just have to accept it and put up with it So anyway, uh, now you know why, you know, all my, <laughs> half my videos are gone, my blogs, and uh, all my comments just kind of disappeared. I'm just going to take a break for a while. I guess I owe you at least that, to tell you the truth instead of just walking away and not saying anything. I realized after I was having a conversation with somebody that I was like, this is stupid. Why am I even having this conversation? You know, first of all, a lot of tactics I don't trust anymore. When I, when I look at some of the people that are coming over and some of the crap that comes with them, you know, you have to really stop and question yourself. Is the site so important and gaining popularity and numbers that you're willing to put up with bullshit? I don't know. I don't know. I'm just going to start telling it like I see it. I mean, you, I know how you guys feel about that. You think I should keep quiet in certain subjects and, and not discuss how I really feel that... You know, some of you have already told me that I make a fool out of myself when I do such things. But that's what my videos are going to be like from now on. I'm not going to go halfway. I'm going to go all the way. So, I guess that's that. <laughs>